Yes, yes! I'm swimming with the fishies. <laughs> and it's a little bit tiny. Um, but yeah, I've kind of been kind of messing around making these little animated kelp things and the uh, the watery grass. Um, need to get a better background, maybe. Um, and you know what? I feel like we maybe need a couple things in here to spruce things up. So let me let me get uh, the diving helmet. I feel like that's pretty watery. I'll grab that. We can put that in here. Uh, let's put it. Let's put it here. I think that's in between two of the items. We just put it like that. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Good stuff. Good stuff. Um, and I can also put. Do I have anything else that would be good? You know, let's put a let's put a bottle of water. You know, we got to make sure we have our Wawa. You know, I just kind of I just can open it up and scoop it right in, and then we have some fresh water. It's perfect. Just kind of lean it against the wall like that. There we go. All right. I think my aquarium is nice and stocked. Let's go ahead and jump into. The Subnautica, right after I make sure everything. Right. Yep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For a second, I didn't remember if I set the game up right. We got that. We got the title. Um, let's jump on in. So. I couldn't resist the urge to open up a bit of Subnautica in the week, but I didn't make any progress, I assure you. All I did was basically swim back to base and reorganize things because uh, I was getting confused and turned around on which which of my floating lockers had what. So I'm like, you know what? Fuck this. I'm actually going to name them. <laughs> so uh, we have a bit of organization going on. Um, I know last time we built the fabrication tool so we can actually like build structures but i think it needs i believe it needed like lead and i think a lot of glass and i don't believe we've gotten a lot of lead we also have the laser cutter and i believe there was a door over at the at the ship that needed um a laser cutter to get into. I don't know why I'm down on health, so let's fix that. Um, let's get a bit of food right fast quick. I think before we jump in to looking for an underwater base location, I think I want to go and get... Um, where are you? Nothing. I think I want to go check the... Uh, ship because there was also the coordinate thing that got uploaded uh, that we do need to go to the ship for so I figure we could do like a quick check on the ship and then uh, we can see where we might want to establish a base um, like we don't have any major Checkpoints to look for. We need sandstone for possible lead. Um, I think there is the alien location uh, data point that I have not opened. Actually, where's some bladder fish? Because I need to make some wawa. I would like a sock pile of wawa. Wawa? Wawa? I'm sw swimming in the ocean. Water, water everywhere and not a drop to drink. How I am parched 
And whoa, holy, mmm, this is. Do items not have like a de I wonder what the despawn setting is, because that's like a giant stockpile of teeth. 30 seconds. Oh, let's uh let's not drown. That would be nice. Uh, because I think our major goal I want to hit, and the reason why we need a damn base is fuck off! Go away! Um our next equipment upgrade needs the modification station, which we're going to need a base to construct in. Go ahead and... Oh. I also learned there's a way to keep the dang thing open if I just hold down shift. Um, I did see a mod that... Because the, the only other complaint I have at the moment is... Crafting is one at a time. And while I found a mod that could perhaps alleviate that... Ooh. I'll look at that later. Um, but it... There was like some weird possible version mismatch possible thing. And I didn't want to potentially corrupt my game. So I will just deal with it. Um, we also had a bunch of teeth. Where's my tooth? We got excellent for all of our eggs. Uh, miscellaneous because I had some overflow. Um, we've got our fish, our glass, our coral. We've got our lithium salt, uh, our pipes. You know, you gotta have your pipes. Very important. We have our processed goods uh, like our ingots. Um, our seed storage. Uh, here's our teeth. And then we've got lead. You know, lead is dead. Um, Alright, so let's save. And go ahead and head on over to the ship. Let me put the laser cutter in our primary hand. There's that door I remember. So... I believe there was codes to something, and then there's that door that may contain delicious goodies. Perhaps letting us build some stuff. Hey, Top of Hope you're having a great weekend. There's also the various wreckages we can now break into, because some of them we needed to have the laser cutter to get in at all. Is this a forklift? Aw, oh, come on! I can't scan a forklift? What is this? 1984? I want an underwater forklift! Just take an entire uh, coral segment into my base whenever I establish it. Oh. So your storage system is splitting via mitosis at a rapid rate. Uh, yeah. Yeah, basically. <laughs> But you know what? Eventually we're going to get to the point where we can store, we can make the bigger storage things, and then uh, we'll be good. And everything will be great. Um, is this a building we couldn't get into? Oh, we need to repair. I see. Well, now I feel dumb. I wonder how many of these things I've missed, because I didn't realize I just needed to repair the door. Hey, Solder! I hope you have a good time foraging out there in the jungle. Plenty of delicious berries. Oof. Man, that is a really good photograph to be lasting underwater like this. That's uh, a grab trap. We already have that. Ooh, sea glide fragment. Nice. Uh, that was basically useless, to be honest, because we don't really need titanium at the moment. I don't think. Well, we'll fill our inventory up with it, because why not? I imagine we might need to be making ingots. So I can go ahead and just make a bunch of ingots and shove them in our processed um, tab. 
I think as a part of my organization efforts, I actually freed up uh, one or two of the storage boxes. What was that? Did I have something? No. So many bioluminescent things. It's so fucking pretty! What is that? Why is the peeper got this little tail? That's kind of cool. Maybe it's in its, uh... Uh, oh, the sharks have like a glowy mouth. <laughs> I'd be like, yes, fish, come towards the light right here. <laughs> That's no moon. Oh, wait, never mind. It, it is. It's just it's just really close. Dawn of the third day. Dawn of the final day. 24 hours remain. I wonder if there's going to be any larger aerial creatures. You know, I don't think so, since this is a very water world planet. I don't think there's really going to be enough to support large um, life forms like that. But maybe, maybe, maybe they'll have some kind of, uh, what do you call it? Like pelican or, you know, one of those giant uh, creatures. I should know more birds. Um, I picked up wingspan from a uh, giveaway, I think. I know I didn't buy it. I was gifted it in some fashion. Um, you feel an evil presence watching you. I'm fine. I'm fine. We just don't look down, and we just keep swimming. And we hope I remember the way into the ship. There it is. Yeah, I can't get lost again. Um, did I bring a fire extinguisher, though? Yes. All right, so we should be good. Damn, when will this dang ship settle? Okay, for a second there, I thought something pulled me underwater and I was about to freak out. About to play Terraria? Yes, a long time ago. Um, when I last played Terraria was when they added the, uh, what is it, the holy and corrupt biome, and they had the sky dragons and things like that. Like, that was the newest thing um, when I last played Terraria. Uh, I've heard they've added a lot of stuff since then, uh, which is really odd for a complete game. Oh, come on. That's a clearly an open corridor. All right. Let's see. Go up and up and up. I want to make sure I don't miss anything. I don't want to get bit by these fucking head crab ass fucking uh, lost in space ass fucking cannibal meat-eating crab fucking guys. Don't play the spooky music. This place shouldn't be spooky at all. It should be a fun, family-safe ride into the burning ship. Oh, I'm really glad the fires didn't reignite. All right, maybe I won't need the uh, fire extinguisher too much. Let's see, was it the over here? No, let me check. Um, uh, high security. Captain's quarters behind the prawn bay. I don't know what the prawn bay is. I would have thought it would have been administration. 
Fires in a closed room sounds like a great combination. Yeah, yeah. You know, the carbon monoxide, like, if you start feeling a little bit lightheaded, that's, that's how you know the carbon monoxide is working. It's, uh, it's like a, it's like a detox, you know? You're, you're just doing an oxygen detox. <gasps> uh... I just... Wait. Man... Man, why you, why you be doing, be, be having like this? Cause I can't put that fire out. We're gonna save before I kill myself. Cause I will. I did it before. I learned that fire hurts. Yeah. There we go. At the low, low cost of half our health. You too can jump into an enclosed room. Uh, okay, so there's all this bullshit. I want, I think the door is over there. Right? Wrong. Forklift! You bastards! Give me the forklift! I'm forklift certified, I swear! Swear on me, mum! Alright, maybe I need to go for a little bit of a swim? Seamus Bay Driver. Alright, nothing in the sea mod. No sea mods. Um, I went to the drive room. This used to be full of water? I don't remember it being full of water. I wonder if the ship does like slowly sink. Maybe I'm crazy. Alright. Maybe this is the door I was thinking of. Thankfully this is a, uh, what is it? Magnesium? Cutting? I forget like what metal they have to use for underwater welding. Took about 20% of the power to cut open. Noted. Good thing it doesn't hurt to go through that metal. Hey, first aid kit. Let's uh, go ahead and use that. Um, what do we have in here? We got some data. Integrating new PDA data. Good shit. Good shit. All right. All right. Um. Got some batteries. Got some more PDAs. Integrating new PDA data. Prawn Bay. All right, so we're making our way to where we need to download. Good shit. Another battery. I think we got enough batteries. The to top off our hydration. I guess they wanted... Why can't I... Oh, I gotta repair. Good thing we got a bunch of batteries. Make sure we got... Uh, energy to get in here. Ooh. I'm gonna save because I feel like I'm going to die. Is this electrified water? No, it looks like we're safe. All right, interesting. Uh, I figured I would have electrocuted to death, but that's what I get for thinking. Ooh. Picking up a faint black box signature, originating on the other side of the hull breach in this room. Ooh. Bronze suit fragment. Interesting. Bronze suit. Ooh, let's get over here and scan this little guy as well. Be a little underwater mech warrior? Mmm, alright. Alright. Me likey. I just gotta, you know, fucking collect 50 billion uh, prints. No signal. Ooh, more prawn suit fragment. Good shit, good shit. Um, 
I don't see anything else to scan or grab. Let's do a little bit of parkour! Parkour! Living quarters. Um, hmm. I don't think this is the breach it was talking about. Maybe the breach is underwater. Let's check the living quarters first, however. Ah, yes. Nutrient blocks. I can scan a, I can make a vending machine. Are you serious? New blueprint acquired. Ah, yes. I love to have me some potato mix and some snack exclamation point. Mmm, my favorite brands. Ooh. Oh, we're gonna scan all sorts of bullshit. Ooh, is that a poster we can take? Keep calm. Hell yeah, Kibti. You're coming with me. Integrating new PDA data. Locked? I have a laser cutter. Let me in. Why I order? Why I order? Oh, I'll give him a what for. Just you wait. There is a lot of water here and nutrient blocks. Interesting. Interesting. Certainly will allow us to keep on exploring. What do we got here? What do we got here? That looks like an electrical hazard. Um, let's see. It was two six seven nine. Two six seven nine. Two six. Yeah, well, fuck you too, buddy. Oh, we... I f don't remember if I have that poster, so we'll go ahead and grab it. Because I am a thief! Taking everything! Open storage. Oh, it's a carry-all. I see. But I can't fit it. What if I eat this and drink some water? There we go. We got a bag. We put... Do we have some quantum storage? No, no quantum storage. All right, so cabin one is not the captain's quarters. From Huggins to Wilson. Tell me we've been on this rig more than a year and you never took a ride on the outside? Well, now you've only gone and gotten yourself a friend with the keys to a giant freaking robot suit. We've plain got nothing to do till we get star side to work on the gate. You want to taste the stars, you've only got to say. My spare prawn suit's got your name on it. You don't know what power feels like till you've crushed an asteroid with your bare, heavily mechanically augmented hands. Want to play catch with a passive meteor? Come to cabin number one. Oh, 18... 1869? 1869? 1869? Interesting choice of numbers, person. Ah! Misclick. Oh! Just... All right. More PDAs. Integrating new PDA data. Arcade gorge toy. All right, we need to make some fucking room. Um, we can. Let's drop the bag. Honestly, I don't need a bag. 
three by three, eh, whatever. Blue cap. I hate that picking things up always makes like a snipping noise. Does not make sense when we're just like picking up a toy or a poster. You know? New just weird. Acquired. Uh, what's in here? Nothing. Blue cap. Incompatible with protective environment suits. Oh, I thought I could pick I thought I could take it out. Man. Alright, let me put the laser cutter. Alright. I'm gonna need a fire extinguisher. Go ahead and grab that. Alright, I'm gonna save just in case that zappy thing zaps me and I die. Oh, it looks like I'm good! Uh, electricity. Ain't fucking shit. Two, six, seven, nine. Two, six, seven, nine. I am the captain now. Aurora miniature. Nice. Love the toys. Oh, we need to make room. You're getting all sorts of random bullshit. Let's drop some, let's drop the titanium. I've got like three containers full of titanium. We're not hurting for it at the moment. We just let it roll around as it is wont to do. Be free, titanium. Free range titanium. Huh? Integrating new PDA data. Escape rocket? Why would I want to escape? Sounds kind of lame. Um, so... I'm uh, not really right. a doctor. I know that's what my ID says, but I never have been. Cheated the medical exams. What does a doctor these days need to know about manually resetting bones? When was the last time a top surgeon actually cut someone open? <laughs> that's what that's robots, what robots are for! Are for. Doctors these days read diagnoses off of computer readouts. For that, I'm perfectly qualified. But what That's good is uh, it when I'm not weird. connected to the main network? I'm bleeding. I've got glowing green pustules growing on my hands. I run a self-scan and it tells me I've got skin irritation. <laughs> the only thing I studied in medical school was how to lie convincingly. What the hell do I know about how to treat an alien disease? I'm actually going to die down here. Like, every person's log that we find, they're all just, like, incompetent or just a jack-off. Just a f fucking fool. It kind of makes it... For a second, I thought it was going to go, like, I'm a doctor, but not, like, a medical doctor. I have a PhD that makes me a doctor, but not, like, one that can help people. <laughs> All right, what was that thing? Not in codes and clues. Survivors? Auxiliary mission orders. Crew of the Mongolian vessel Degasi. Oh! So that's why the Aurora came over here. Because we found the Degasi. Interesting. Mongolian vessel Agassi disappeared a decade ago, carrying with it a high-ranking Mongolian chief. Corporate insurance has purchased passage aboard the Aurora for MS6R. No orders are to make every reasonable effort to locate and retrieve Degasi crew members without compromising the primary mission. Unfortunately, uh, you got in range of the uh, planetary defense system. Oh, additional aquatic and all-terrain vehicles have been included for this mission. Oh, that is... This is a really interesting way to 
explain why exactly this ship has so many like water specific stuff and it's not just you know them wang jangling in like this is really i like this this is really good like justification of why it's like oh why would a spaceship crash landing on this planet have all these things like they were they were they meant to come here they specifically got these things Okay, so, um, I don't want to read the Torgals yet. I want to get some more. So, I think we got last recorded transmissions. Yes. Average long range transmission delay, eight hours. Opening last recorded transmissions. This is an emergency distress call. Aurora is on collision course with planet 4546B. Sending all available environmental data. Please respond. Strange they didn't respond with uh, shot this down. This is Altera HQ. Attached to this message, you should find the blueprints for an escape ship that we calculate will be capable of breaking orbit and getting you back to the nearest phase gate. Now, it's designed to use materials you can find and sit you, but it's going to need one hell of a power source. Now, we'll be sure to... Aurora Long Range Communications, really, offline. Okay, so that's where we got the document. So... <laughs> Responsible autonomous relationships. Don't fall in love with your robot AI. Got it, all right, all right. Uh, where is... Is it in vehicles? Neptune Escape Rocket. All right, so that would get us off into the nearest phase gate. Oh, we, we have a power source. So the launch platform, gantry, stage one, stage two, stage three, one person. All right, all right. Onboard AI will not launch if local threats are detected. Use of alien materials to power the craft may increase its range in unpredictable ways. I wonder if you can get an accidental game over by launching without doing anything about the planetary defense guns. So it's like you're, hey, you're escaping velocity, and then, oh, damn, directed energy blast obliterates you. Completely vaporized. Or if, uh... Yeah, I think, wasn't there another thing Thing. There was the life support, I think I saw it mention. I need all of these to clear out, please. want all of you to go away. Thank you. Do I have to hover for a second? I do. I'm going to... The notifications bug me. Uh, I'm going to clear all of these things out. All right, so blueprints. So, sea glide launch platform. I actually can kind of build that already, but I don't know why you would want to leave this amazing water world. All right, all right. We got a bunch of this bullshit. We got yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah, uh-huh. Clear clear all these buttons. Clear all these buttons. Get the fuck out of my screen. All right. Interesting. So we got a way to leave, but uh, I feel like this planet has a lot more interesting things to explore first. Okay. Um. Don't believe we checked all of this area. Nope. Integrating new PDA data. Fucking fire! Fucking fire's hot! Busty! Uh, we should chug a bit of Wawa. Those nutrient bars are very effective, so I can let myself get pretty low on food. Not too worried about that. Integrating new PDA data. We are getting a lot of batteries. Bloody hell. Why are there so many carryalls? I can't. Can I? Hold on. 
let me draw, let me put four things inside of it. I don't think I ever tested, actually, now that I think about it. So let's put, put these in there. Bag is not empty, cannot pick up. Nope. Yep, it's useless. I'm sad we can't use bags inside bag. We can, like, fucking Tarkov that shit and just <laughs> have a quantum storage of bags. Alright, so... Cabin 5 looks fine. It's fine! Cabin 5 is fine. Uh, batteries are more important than water. Not really. Batteries are actually kind of easy to make now that I think about it. It's just the acid mushroom and something. So you know what? The fact that we're getting all these batteries is actually kind of useless. Um, I don't think we can get into that cabin even if we put out this fire. I'm not even going to try. I think we've looted all of the cabin areas. So I think all we have left is to check under the water. Let's go ahead and save our progress. <gasps> All right, let's break a leg real quick. Don't need them. Legs are overrated. Um, that is a fire extinguisher. I want my flash light. Thank you. All right, yep. Yep, that's, uh, them's, them's some pipes, all right. Yep. These, uh, they're really, really, uh, piping that stuff real good, you know? Just, uh, just, uh, piping it left and, uh, piping it right, you know? Maybe a bit of a piping down and, uh, and an upwards pipe. Uh-huh. Yep. It's, uh, some good, good piping. Not sure how much more there is to find in the ship, because there's just that door. Um, that's blocked off. This is where we came through. Uh, we are chock full of goodies, however. So even if there is potentially more stuff, I am inclined to leave it for another time. Ah! Ooh. Ah! Fuck off! Fucking leech! Where'd you come from? Fuck you! Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. It's a good thing someone decided to heavily purify this ocean in case someone's ship crashed and someone needed to swim past exposed wires. Yeah, 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 yeah. Or just like the physics of this world, electricity ain't shit. <laughs> All right. Let's get the bug out of here. Let's get out of here. All right, all right, all right. Got a bit of a daylight. Good shit, good shit. Love to see it. Nice and bright. Go away, crab. Go away, quab. Quab, go away. Whee! Crunch. All right, let's save. Look at that! We're just, uh, you know what? Hey, let's, let's just check out what's over here. You know? It's, uh, like, uh, just, uh, maybe, maybe there's something to scan over here. You know, maybe, maybe we get blueprints for an entire spaceship. Fuck off, crabs. Alright, let's fucking. Get out of here. Let's not waste our flashlight. Oh boy. Yeah, thanks for the thanks for the spooky music game. Actually give me the good good bops. Huh? 
Why you give me why you give me the spoops? I want your bops. Okay, so we visited the main ship. Now it's time to look at our options for base building. Yeah. That's sandstone. I think it's going to be limestone. Limestone, yep. Limestone. Limestone. I don't want your fucking limes! I want your sand! Metal, metal, everywhere, and not an ingot to forge. It's okay. I have an emotional support, um, Drucky Snail to get me through these troubling times. We kind of have a bit too much food and water, though. It's like, I don't want to throw it away, but I don't want to waste it. I wonder if we can get to a point where we can make those nutrient bars. I feel like we would have to get, like, a whole bunch of fish, and then we, like, process... Or I think we would need to get like a whole bunch of food, different food items, and then they can all be mushed into a nutrient bar. Let's get back to our uh, escape pod and take a look at what we might need for base building. And drop the base. Wow. Yeah, yeah, nice little kelp forest. Still quite terrifying. You get uh, get tangled up in a kelp forest and uh, then drown. So carry carry a knife on you, a very sharp knife that can cut through kelp. Peeper, I know you want me to eat you, but I have plenty of granola bars. Uh, you can you can jeepers creepers your peeper on away. Eight. Oh, the good music starts kicking in right when we get to our damn ship. Man. Oh, we have a radio message. I see. Um, go ahead and craft that into glass. Why not? Uh, we can make some wawa. We can put... Why do I have an egg in here? I need to fix that. Uh, we need to put this bullshit in here. Grab the egg so I can put it where it goes. We can put the partially used fire extinguisher. We'll keep the full one. We don't need this many batteries. I just want one to keep on hand. So we'll do that. Um, go ahead and use that med kit, because why not? Um, let me see. I feel like... Why does that one not have a name? Where's my... So lithium salt, lithium salt, copper... Full of copper. Where's my money one? Actually, glass. Eesh. Glass. Alright, we have two full of glass. Lithium salt, lithium salt, pipes, pipes. Um, processed goods. 
Uh, I think we could put the power cell and our extra batteries in there. We'll put that glass, I guess. Um, teeth, lead. Where's my excellent? We do not have this egg stored. Noted. So we're going to put it in here. Um, I could have sworn I had one where I was putting all of my gold and so There it is. There's monies. It's full. Yeah, that'll do it. That'll do it. Ah, there's Yepit's Titanium. Alright, so we'll put that in there. Um, and then we're gonna drop this quartz we have. Because it we need two quartz for glass. I can't believe it's not titanium. Yeah, I have plenty of titanium. Not so much lead, which is my limiting factor, I think. Oh, you know what? I can make another glass. Hold on. Where did I throw it? Bada bing, bada boom, baby. Everything's coming up direct. Play the radio message. This is life pod seven. Coordinates attached. Pod is structurally sound, but the fabricators bust. Requesting assistance. Seven out. Signal coordinates corrupted. Approximate transmission origin recorded to date to bank. That guy kind of sounded like the, uh, I'm not a doctor. Kind of, kind of had that that sort of sort of thing that uh, was in the voice. Huh. All right, so we do have something to check out. Let me store this glass, and then let's look at what we need for the modification station. So we need it for, we can basically build, we just, yeah, it's going to be a big upgrade if we can get the modification station. Um, modification station that we cannot build. Ooh, a battery charger. Oh, we can't build the modification station. Great. Awesome. Love that for me. Fan-fucking-tastic. Alright, so for a foundation, we need titanium and lead. And then... Probably a... Plastic... We can't make plasteel. Enameled glass. Large room with a glass dome. Reinforcement. So lithium titanium. I don't know. What does it what does it look like if I take out the habitat builder? Alright, let me clear out all these damn things. So base pieces. Basic tubular. Okay, okay. So I wonder if I do I I probably do need to build a foundation. Low structural integrity. Interesting. A lot of this is looking like we need titanium and glass. So that's not too bad. Seems any curved surface might need the enameled glass. How do I get solar panel down underwater though? Or if that's for something closer to the surface? Extends the range of a power source. I wonder how that works.
Wall lockers. Oh, that's what we really need. Or just lockers. Large freestanding storage. I don't I wonder which one stores more. Then we need to make the grow beds. And the aquarium. Aquarium's gonna be an important one. Alright. Um but for the base. I don't know. There's not really been a good place for us to build yet. I might want to look at the... I might want to finally take a look at the alien stations. Alien facility locations. Let's see. Where's Life Pod 7? Crew reports. My fabricator. 200 meters. In an area of low ecological activity. One kilometer southwest of the Aurora's Stern. What the what fucking part of a boat is the stern? I think it's the back. Stern part of ship. The back. Yep, it is the back. Calorie intake recommended. So two one kilometer southwest of where the engines are. Get a granola bar. Drink some waba. All right, we can check that out. Um, there was another thing. What was it? This thing. Uh, we can we can make this. Or it's torqued into thrust via propeller. Ooh. We need lubricant, copper wire, and titanium. What do we need for copper wire? Advanced materials. Ooh. Polyaniline. Interdasting. Oh, there's the plasteel ingots. I can make those. Let's see. All right, we have plenty of lubricant, so I just need the copper wire. So we just need two copper. Two copper, the lubricant, titanium, and all right, one of our batteries. So where is our processed goods and our... There it is. Lubricant, battery, and copper. Got to get the copper wire. Actually, we have overflow of copper. Overflow of copper. Copper in the miscellaneous. 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 Forgot to get the titanium. Because I am a foolish serpent. That's lithium, not, let's not get a giant chunk, we just need one, just, just one, one more titanium, alright, see what the fuck this is, seems like it make us move faster, the sea glide will increase your effective exploration range, for your safety please pack supplies for long journeys, and stay within five kilometers of the nearest life pod or habitat. You're not right, real mom. I'm gonna go as far as I want. Propulsion can. All right. Um, that is a big thing of my job. Do I put it into a slot? Yes, I do. All right. So if I pull it out, it has a map. Interesting. Reloads with a battery. All right, we have an extra battery. Um. All right, let's take it out for a spin, I guess. Then you go one kilometer from the engines, so we head this way. Oh, that 
That is a map. God damn. Oh, this thing is guzzling power. Noted. I'm gonna check for more sandstone. Cause I do not have a lot of lead. Alright. Um, I think with this, I don't need to take my pipes to get down the 200 meters. I think we can just use this thing to go down 200 meters. Alright, so... Oh, fuck! Oh, fuck! Oh, fuck! Oh, fuck! I don't know what I'm doing. Run, 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 run. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing! Ah! Oh, God! Fuck off! Fuck off! Fuck off! Go away! Go away! Ah! Ah! Fuck! 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 I was just going to the ship! Leave me alone! Ah, I don't know what I'm doing! Leave me alone! 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 I'm afraid to turn around. I'm afraid to turn around. Pop a med kit. <gasps> Pop another med kit. Is it behind me still? Oh, God. Oh, fuck me, man. Fuck me, man. Man, fuck me, man. Oh, blood and ashes. I don't, I don't think I saved before I started heading out either. I don't remember the last time I saved. So I think we should save right now while we're alive. Um, let's see. One kilometer southwest of the stern. We need to head basically straight that direction. Fish just wanted a hug. Yeah, with his fucking teeth. Okay, so to get one kilometers southwest, where's my bacon? Bacon. You know what? Yeah. We need to be about one kilometer away from that bacon. I'm gonna stay close as fuck to the surface. No! No fucking shot! No, nope, I didn't see it. I didn't see anything. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. This is fine. This is fine. This is fine! Ah! Ah! We're not fine! Opposite of fine, we're terrible! Oh, fuck me! Leave me alone, man! Leave me alone! I'm just a guy! I'm just a little worm! Leave me alone, man! I just want to swim! Uh, did we lose him? No, we didn't lose him at all! Where the fuck is he, man? Where the fuck is he? Just keep swimming, 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 just keep swimming! Just keep swimming. <sighs> Dodge! Dodge! Fucking can't catch me, bro! I don't want to go down. I need the I need oxygen, actually. Oh, I think we lost him. Let's get some air and check how far we've gotten from the bacon. Need another 400 meters out. Oh, fuck me, dude. Fuck me. What are you? Oh, it's one of those... Yeah, I've scanned that before already. They're just kind of chilling. Interdasting. We're kind of aligning with Stargate SG-2. Oh, uh, we can just float backwards. That's kind of cool. 
All right, so we're about a kilometer out. So now we need to go down 200 meters. Kind of wish I had another bacon. Oh, right. We do have a depth meter. It's right on our compass. I forgot. Okay, so 200 meters. Nice. Ice stock. Interesting. Get a sample. Interesting. Interesting. Metal salvage. Why the fuck not? Sandstone. Give me that lead, baby. Limestone. All right. Um. We're a kilometer out. We're 200 kilometers down. Now I guess it's just kind of futzing about. Do you find it? Was 200 kilometers down, right? 200 down, yep. All right, uh, we need to surface. So let's go get the Wawa. Man, this, uh, this sea glide is pretty sick nasty. Oh, this is great. Now this is an upgrade. Basically going down 10 meters per second. That is perfect. I also feel like our oxygen isn't going down as fast. I'm wondering if like the act of swimming counts as like exertion which causes our oxygen to drop in particular and we need like a fucking drill so we can get at these things what are you nothing it's up here brain thing Life pod. Life pod, life pod, where are you gonna be? I don't want you to be a death pod, so life pod, where you be? Life pod, life pod, I don't think your coordinates were right but the aft is quite large I'm saying the ship had a big aft and when I say it had a big aft I mean it had a big ass cuz it's a spaceship on a water planet water being a metaphor for space. Maybe. Just maybe. We can swim in space as well. <clears throat> this is not raining. Oh, have <laughs> So you wonder what the weather patterns would be for a completely water-covered planet like this. Like, we already know how water works when it's, like, set- Ah, fuck, it's tiger plants! Fuck you guys! Um, you know, our planet is, like, 70% water, 80% water. But I wonder if that extra, like, 20% has a significant effect on things. I don't need salt. <laughs> the fuck? Is there a tiger plant somewhere? 
I bet there is. There's a goddamn tiger plant. Oh. Hold on. Scanner room. Alright. Scan the scanner room. Whoa. Scan section going on. I thought that would have been an indicator of the life pod. But that's what I get for sinking. Oh, let's not drown, Drecky, Drecky, don't drown, Drecky, 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 please don't drown. Drecky, don't drown. Do not drown. Wait. I feel like I'm stupid. Let me check that thing again real quick. No, it's one kilometer. Southwest. For a second there, I was like, wait a minute. Did it actually mean two kilometers? There, we're about... About a kilometer out. So the opposite of southwest would be northeast. bit closer. I think we need to search back this direction. What are you? Ooh, more scanner room. Hey, Duke! Welcome on by! Sarkis, nice to see you too. I see you're playing some more Alien Isolation. I hope that's... How dare you, Duke? I'm in the deep ocean! How could you throw me into the void as well? You monster! You finished? Nice! Nice! Well, come on by, Atmospheric Black Metal and Pacifus Pariah and Armdaren. Welcome on by. If you don't know me, hello, I'm the worm way down here. Actually, hold on, wait. I can fix this. Uh, let, me, let me get out of my aquarium for a second. I am Drekki Ormer, a Draconic Serpent, a Flightless Dragon, or simply a worm on the internet. <laughs> Threw you into the deepest trench. No, you monsters! Uh, I don't know how long you were gaming, but uh, streaming is hard work, so you should... <laughs> made myself too tiny. You should take some well-earned rest. You know, go leave a piss. Go take a water. Um, probably not from the same place you just pissed, but you know, you do you. I'm not your I'm not your keeper. Um, and take a little bit of a break, because I am just getting started. Um, I'm playing Subnautica. Uh, if you don't know Subnautica, um, it is very much a water underwater game. If you didn't notice from where my current screen is sitting at. Uh, so if you have philosophobia or anything like that. Um, this is your content warning. Uh, if you got a piece out, that is perfectly acceptable. And I hope to see you around some other time. Uh, for anyone who has played Subnautica, be aware that I'm playing blind, so please don't spoil me on anything. Um, as far as where we are in the story, I just got some blueprints to get an escape rocket, but who the fuck wants to build that when we have a really cool water world to explore? Um, and right now I'm looking for a life pod. Um, and I just made this little, I think it's called the Sea Glide. Uh, it has been pretty nice, uh, because this life pod is 200 meters below water. And I would have had to assemble the pipes and do a lot of diving elsewise. More monsters, prettier than aliens, though. <laughs> I don't know, man, those xenophores, I mean, it's got two mouths, so, uh, I don't know, man. Think of the possibilities. Oh, welcome to the Ziggurat Pacifist Pariah. Hope you enjoy your time here. 
he was going to go to the bathroom. <laughs> I'm just glad we have not run into the giant fucker once again. We just have these uh, bony shark dudes. And fucking tiger plants. Fucking tiger plants, mate. Oh, sandstone. Nah, we want lead, baby, lead. Delicious, delicious lead. Everyone loves lead. It's so tasty. Uh, we need to surface. I would prefer to not drown. Get some lunch and enjoy the fish. I will very much enjoy the fish. Although I will enjoy it more if we can find this damn escape pod. Alright, so... We're still 200 meters out. This is the aft, right? Aft of ship is the rear of the boat. Yeah? And it should be... Let's see. Maybe, maybe I need to look... I need to use more of the... I want to look for these kind of rocky formations. We've seen a couple areas with like those, those little spines. All right. Let's go back down and give a another gander. We have plenty of supplies after raiding the Aurora, so I'm not too concerned about food or Wawa. All right, we're not down far enough. I also cannot fucking see now. Ooh. I didn't think about using the map. I wonder if the map will show it. Maybe not. Hmm. Not down far enough though. Gotta get to 200 meters. Um, and we're kind of going a little bit too far out. Oh, mm, these are kind of looking like ridges. Ooh, what's this? Scanner room fragment. All right. That's spoopy as fuck. Ooh. What are those? Oh, hold on. Let's surface and dive straight back down here, actually. Kinda gonna want some daylight. Okay, so no, that's sunset. Is that sunrise? Yeah, it's sunset. Ugh, man, it is kind of finicky to stay on top of the wa water sometimes. All right, all right. So I'm gonna go straight back down. I'm gonna check out those orbs. Wonder if that was a sign of a facility. I still need to look at the alien facilities data tab thing. I keep I keep getting distracted by something else. Uh, the game definitely is doing a good job of constantly having a source of something to do. Anchor pod. Interesting. Indigenous life forms. Can we take a sample? Cannot take a sample. Goopy guy. We love little goopy guys. Membrane tree. Sample. All right, we got a seed. Good shit, good shit. Ooh. Ooh. Interesting. 
Interesting. We are really fucking far away from where we need to be. Oh shit! What the fuck? Oh fuck that shit. Alright. You know what? I've uh, changed my mind. We're, we're going back. Hold on. If I go straight up. Right now it says we're 1,000 or 1,100. I wonder where it's going to put us. You died it. Oh no, Pokemon. Well, uh, did, did you did you get better? You may have died, but did you at least get better? <laughs> Welcome on by. Hello, oh, Banana Great Friday. It's always nice when the week is over. Alright, we need to get closer to um, 1,000 meters. Died, but thankfully you lived. Constant distractions, that sounds like Subnautica. Yeah. Like, I thought I would bounce off of Subnautica. I kind of did it because I needed something. Uh, I played Outlast and I'm like, mm, I'm done with spooky games. I think I'm good. Um, and I'm like, well, I got Subnautica sitting there because I, I think a friend gifted it to me to check out. And, like, I don't really like Minecraft. It's too open world for my taste. Um, I kind of prefer Terraria because I need, like, a... I need, like, some kind of goal to really aim myself towards. But Subnautica has been pretty good about having a clear thing to be progressing towards. That has certainly kept me engaged. Plus, the, uh, the environment is pretty fucking cool. Uh, <gasps> found it! We fucking found it! Let's fucking go! Our inventory is full. Uh, we can fix that. Um... Alright, we got the PDA. Integrating new PDA data. Alright, alright, alright. Um... Cylindrical sample flask. Alright, we need this toy car though. Let's do that, let's do that. I meant to eat and drink that. All right. Um, uh, click. There we go. All right. Let's get the fuck out of here before we drown, because that would be very awkward. You don't like 60 million meter by 60 million meter worlds? No. No. Like, I don't know. It's also like, I don't, I don't know, the graphics are also kind of off-putting to me, like, I know it's the shtick, everything is a block, like that's, that, that, that's the thing, but like, it's just kind of off-putting to me, this feels weird, and like, I don't need realistic graphics or anything like that. I have certainly. I, I played. I played Door Fortress without a uh, tile pack, where everything's just like ASCII. You fear, you cower in fear at the horde of capital E's running amok across your fortress. All right, we need to pick up our um, bacon. Got some good jams coming on now, baby. Have I saved? I'm gonna save. <laughs> Didn't see us. Stand still. We're fine. This is fine. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. Alright, back to getting our, uh, pipe bacon. 
Hold on, give me a sec. No, the frogs! You fool! Oh crap! Oh you my god! The monster! Shit. No! 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 Pokemon, no! The frogs! They can't swim in- Ah, oh, fuck! Pokemon, you summoned it! Why did you do that to me? You monster! Fuck, 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 fuck. I'm gonna make it. I'm gonna make it. I need to make room. I need to make room. I need to make room. Fuck the titanium. Give me the bacon. Give me the bacon. All right. We'll save again. All right. I don't think it's chasing us. I think we can get the fuck out of here. At worst, maybe we can clip into the ship again and escape. Aha! I can't get us out here! Good thinking, Drecky. Good thinking. Alright, let's head back home. And then we will check out that data pad. We'll swap out our dead battery for a fresh one. Fresh battery. Hmm, I'm kind of thinking... The best place to make my base might be super far underwater because then it becomes a checkpoint. The only thing is, is like, how is there oxygen down there? I feel like I need, I would need to build a pipe down to it. So I'm a little worried of wasting a bunch of resources on a place I can't actually use as a um, jumping off point. What am I doing? That. All right, so we need to put Oh, right. Sample flask. Ah, so it's just it's just a placeable item. Noted. Okay. Uh, um This here. Swap those. We need to make another locker. So let's see. Uh, let's not waste our battery. No reason not to. So miscellaneous. Where's our seed? Pipes. Processed goods. See. Oh, wait. Do we already have. Hold on. Is it full? Right. That's terrestrial. That's how I was splitting it. So we're going to need. Need another one. Let me name it. Let me name it. All right, so we can pop those over there. Good shit. Our miscellaneous one. That's excellent. Literally just dropped you. Processed goods. Where did I fucking put beef? Lead, money, 18. As you can see, the patented Drecky storage flotilla is a highly efficient system of organizing all manner of objects. Um, <laughs> and not losing anything whatsoever. I'm literally going in circles now. Tricky. 
Why are you just called Locker? Just do that. Uh, what else do I have to offload? I have some lead and titanium. Also, now that we're at our safe ship, we're also going to save here. Last thing I want to do is die, load up my save at the back of the ship, and have the giant fish just fucking bite my face off. Um, 9 out of 10 dentists recommend not getting your face bitten off by a giant fish. Um, I don't know. I don't know. I feel like I should take the dentist's advice on this one. I don't know what that tenth dentist is. Uh, it was kind of a really long dentist, uh, with a weird mustache and glasses. And the lab coat really didn't fit on it. That, that dentist also would only meet me, like, at the pier. It was kind of weird that it's, uh, it did its practice, like, in the water as well. I found that kind of strange, but, you know, it seemed like a, seemed like a pretty swim-up guy. You know, I didn't really have too many complaints. That lead uh, is lead. Where is my lead? Lithium salt, lithium salt. Lead is dead. There's lead. Why is there gold in my lead? You son of a bugger. I think I was overly ambitious making a second lead, uh... Um... Oh, I need to put... I need to put egg. Monday egg. There we go. Alright. Um... Battery. Right. Battery swap. Do that. Um. Yes. I don't have anything on the radio. I think uh, there was that data thing we picked up. So let's check that. Life pod 7. I've tried everything. The analysis circuits on the fabricator are fried can barely manufacture the most basic of materials. Want a battery? Here, have a children's toy. Need deep sea diving equipment? Have some lab tech. Hungry? I'll turn that fruit into dust for you. I'm going forward with trial and error. I hit every button here, it's got to make something useful eventually. Oh man, whoa, that sucks. That's why we found the fucking toys and shit. Ah. I love, I think this game is doing a very good job of environmental storytelling of just the stuff being lying around and tying them with the various uh, settlements we've found. Um, really, really good uh, synergy of what's going on. Um, let's finally look at the alien facility locations because probably should do that. 800 meters down, 1200 meters down, sanctuaries. Even of an outbreak, quarantine procedures will be automatically enforced with immediate effect. Quarantine enforcement platform will target all incoming and outgoing craft to prevent the spread of infection off world. Cave system with extensive fossil record southwest of the enforcement platform. Synthesis of the antidote for highly infectious bacterium designated Kara. I mean, it gives us directly the... I presume this is like the minimum stuff for quote-unquote beating this game. You know, you have to do something with the antidote and then you have to do something with the power. Then we have hints of some other items. Those are very deep down. 
Well, I guess we have a goal. We will definitely... So I think we would need to build our facility probably at... I think with a sea glider, we could get down to about 300 or 400 meters somewhat safely. I feel, I'd feel more comfortable at 300. I feel like 300 meters down would be a good jumping off point because we do need to manufacture um, some upgrades. We're missing, we're missing some shit to get the fucking... Uh, um, not multi-purpose room, Drecky. Okay, where's the bullshit? Modification station. That is our big pinch point right now is the modification station. I would also like to have the fucking battery charger because we're starting to stack up. Um, that... helps oxygen from a powered habitat to an attached pipe network. I wonder if we need to build our bases in 200 meter segments because about 200 meters is as far actually no I, I can only make the pipes about a hundred meters down before they start getting really squiggly and if I have to pipe the water down scanner room range upgrade Magnify. I feel like the scanner room would be pretty damn useful. Oh, fuck it. Modification station. Uh, do I have... Hold on. I have some upgrades. Cyclops. This is the sea glide. This, uh... Is this the thing I can use? This is sea moth? What's the sea moth? Sea glide. Alright, I guess the sea glide is not a sea moth. That's. Alright. Why did I get these upgrades? I don't even have these things! Why do you do this to me, game? All right, um... Advanced the enzyme... Oh, peeper specimen was observed emitting a faint fluorescent enzyme trail engaging in unusual behavioral patterns. It was actively approaching other creatures, including predators. The specimen is host to a bacterial infection. However, the infection is currently dormant. Stomach cavity contains an unknown enzyme of foreign origin. Your superficial stomach needs the stomach enzymes of larger predators. Contact with the enzyme appears to inhibit the symptoms of bacterial infection. Complex structures render synthesis impossible. Interesting. I wonder if the peepers then were basically... Genetically engineered to combat the bacteria in the overall ecological chain. Because there is the, there is the, sort of like how some fish have toxic amounts of heavy metals. Um, it's because the heavy metals are in the things that they eat. And, you know, it starts concentrating up into the food chain. I forget the specific term of what that's called. Um, so I wonder if part of the alien's solution into, like, passively distribute a cure is by ha seeding the ocean with these creatures and, you know, having the bacteria resistance or immunity or whatnot build up in the ecosystem until it starts hitting a tipping point and the bacterium starts dying out overall because it can't, it can't survive in enough creatures to continue propagating. Hmm. Very, very interesting. Ah, so that's the Cyclops. Ah, that's the Sea Moth. Alright, that's the Prawn Suit. Cool. Alright. 
mobile vehicle bay. I see. What do I still have a blueprint of that I need to check off? An unusual doll. I feel like that's one of the devs. Why is that in whole plates? That's a silly place. Okay. Um... Let me get a few things to start building a base, and we'll we'll go to uh, Stargate SG One, and kind of look southwest for a place to make our first base. I think that's going to be our plan. Um, before we do that, though. I'm going to save. <laughs>